we got Linda finishing up. Let's see, there's the bucket of feathers. I already did the deed outside. And uh, Linda's finishing up with plucking the feathers. You guys got to know how to do this if you want to live. I'm serious. If you if you guys go to the grocery store, you, you got to kind of get over that. You got to learn how to. And these are our chickens we raise, and you know. Uh, well, I'll show you. This is not what you would call a um, genetically modified chicken or GMO fed chicken or whatever. Yes, this is not Tyson or. It's not like the normal size. Uh, yeah. So we're going to have chicken for dinner. Mm. I was actually going to do some tomatoes today, but. Well, this guy just did not want to stay out of my tomatoes and he caught a stick upside the head and that was it for him. So, you guys need to learn how to, if you're going to eat your food, you need to learn how to process it. I mean... It's not that it, hard. No, it really isn't. It didn't take long as soon as we found out that we had to have a, a, uh, to kill a chicken because this chicken just can't learn. And we haven't had chicken in a while anyway. Mm -mm. So, this is actually a free range organic, completely organic chicken. And um, that's probably going to be cut off anyway, but I Look like them little itty bitty legs. Yeah. Wow. It's not like the ones you see at the convenience store that look like turkey legs. So anyway, guys, I suggest everybody learn how to, if you're going to eat food, don't go to the supermarkets. Learn how to do this stuff yourself because one day you may have to do this. And if you don't know how to do it, you know, well, I guess somebody will teach you, but they're only going to show you once, and then you're on your own. And there's a lot of videos on YouTube that'll show you how to do this. Kenny's going to go outside because I'm going to say I'm about done, mm -hmm. and um, that looks pretty defeathered to me. How about you? Yep. Okay, and uh, Kenny will go and take its guts out the right way. And uh, yes, we're going to have chicken for dinner. Hey guys, peace, love, truth always, and Linda's out. We probably should have showed you how to to do this, but you have to make sure that you don't bust the uh, um, the poop little sack there, because if you do, it'll contaminate your um, chicken. The only thing left inside right now is lungs, and it had three eggs. Check this one out. You see that? In here, look at there. That's the process of having. That's the eggs. process. These, these are actually young. These were. Um, we got these in when March? Uh, March 1st. March 1st. And we really didn't want to kill it, but this one accidentally got hit in the head, so it was dead. It was struggling, so Kenny killed it. Inside there is lungs, and then we'll wash it out, and it's pretty much should be ready to go. Um, I just wanted to show you guys. I don't know if any of you know that some of these sacks and stuff cannot be busted or it will contaminate your chicken. So um, anyway, the process of cleaning the chicken. Chicken looks very good. It doesn't smell bad at all. Here's chicken feet. I'm not trying to gross you people out, but you guys have really got to learn how to to do your own food. I mean, it's essential that you do. And uh, peace, love, truth to everybody, and I'm out.